Oh, basically, um, yesterday I was talking to you about mixed match challenge, about Braun Strowman and Alexa Bliss being so dominant, and the plans for WrestleMania 34. Um, about WrestleMania 34, uh, I think that there's gonna be Ronda Rousey versus Charlotte, and then maybe Carmella Cash is in. Uh, I think between those two, I think that Charlotte will still win, and then Carmella will cash in, and either Carmella will win or Charlotte. In that case, if there's Ronda Rousey versus Charlotte for the championship, and Carmella cashes in, in my opinion, Charlotte will lose the championship to Carmella. But, again, that might not happen, and that might. So, November 2018, week one, speak with Baron Blade at the production area. There's Mad Bloom. Security. Let's see what we can do. Come on, Hideo Tami. Let's go. Okay. Was only now given the rundown on you. Good things, I imagine. Hmm. Remains to be seen. High level of hype moving around you. I'm here to see that it's real or goes in the right direction. Don't know what you're good at yet no one's telling me either except for all this baseless glowing praise i want specifics all around great at everything give me a chance to show you right now i'm still learning me i'm a megastar great at absolutely everything you can throw me at so an arrogant an Arrogant type. Oh, okay. Wonderful. That's not me. I'm realistic about my abilities and honest to a fault. Great at everything includes stretching the truth in front of me like putty. Got it? Match card is over that way. Take a gander and get back to me with what you want to have a go at. We'll build off that. <coughs> so a good choice this year. <coughs> not like... The past years, this happened a little bit in 2K15, sometimes where you get to pick your match card. So attention, this is the match card screen. From here you can strategize over how you want to proceed with tonight's show. Attention, you can view the matches for the night. You can also schedule run-ins and promos through this screen. After you confirm your selection for the night, you will go into tonight's show. A run in on the NXT champion Bobby Roode, a promo, or going up against Hideo Tami in a one on one normal match. I want a normal match for now, so I will accept the Hideo Tami challenge. Um, because I'd rather go into a match than to um run in or do promos because I had those three choices um, battle it out in the ring. <coughs> Or um, actually do promos or run in. And I picked the one to fight in the ring. Which is the best choice out of the three for me. So the NXT crowd is pumped up. And Orlando, Florida. NXT TakeOver is in about four weeks time I think. And I'm going to be scheduled in a championship match. <clears throat> which is pretty good I just came to NXT and I have a championship match so tonight on NXT Matthew Storm versus Hideo Tami coming up next I uh, hope that I win because I do not want to start off on a bad uh, leg I might say I really like the matches between Hideo Tami and Alastair Black because they're both pretty good at NXT, especially Aleister Black. So, our very first match. I'm going to save the screenshot or video or whatever. I'm going to name it Debut. Yeah. <coughs> and let's save it so it will be a memory to remember from my career mode. <coughs> <clears throat> I 
Hideo Tami. I wish that CM Punk could, turn, could return at WrestleMania 33, or at least the Monday Night Raw or Tuesday Night SmackDown after WrestleMania. Um, by the way, I'm sorry if I said WrestleMania 33, I meant to say 34. Clothesline from Hideo Tami. NXT is like the show, for those who don't know, the one after your training is complete. So first you're at the performance center trying to train to go up to the main roster right away or NXT usually people go to NXT after the performance center and not up to the main roster right away but some people <coughs> did that um, and you might be saying then how did John Cena and Triple H and stuff like that not go to NXT at that time when they started wrestling like you know Hunter Hearts Hel Helmsley that character who was Triple H back in the day at that time they certainly did not have NXT and if they did I wouldn't even think that they would put him in NXT because he is um, really talented and, uh, and above NXT so oh, what is this this is like Naomi's signature right <coughs> Speaking of Naomi, she's like, she returned after her little bit of an injury, but lately, like, I don't think she was on the last SmackDown Live. If she was, it's up against Ruby Riot, Liv Morgan, or of course, Sarah Logan, which I am tired of seeing already. We've seen like 20 matches already, man, between all those three, or six, or whatever. The match I would love to see is Beth Phoenix since she returned. Why not put her up against uh, Mickey James or even, you know, Trish Stratus or Lita? That would be a pretty sick match to have two Hall of Famers go at it, you know. And you know, like the past matches with Kelly Kelly, the rivalries with Beth Phoenix, Mickey James. And then we have Lita and Trish Stratus. I don't know why in the Royal Rumble they didn't do they didn't do um either um you know in the royal rumble mickey james and trish stratus faced off in the royal rumble and mickey james got eliminated by trish i don't know why they didn't put lita in that mix or after um trish eliminated mickey why they didn't leave Lita in the match to not be eliminated by becky of course and then you know have lita and trish stratus go at it that would be kind of cool, because Lita and Trish Stratus, as we all know, had that wonderful ladder match a long time ago, and it was amazing, so why not have them go up against each other one more time? Because I don't think that if uh, Trish and Mickey weren't facing off in the Royal Rumble, I don't think it would ever happen, because... Uh, it wouldn't be realistic to have them face off at WrestleMania. I, I mean, not that it wouldn't be at all, but like you know, now you have the new talents. You can't just be bringing older people because then you need to bring Kelly Kelly, Beth Phoenix, Mick James, Trish Stratus. You can just if you're gonna do like old type matches at WrestleMania or at a pay per view or normal show, you have to bring everybody, not only one or two people. Kick out by Hideo. We're doing pretty good. Three star match. He's already at a, a at a comeback. We are a little bit of a green health right there if you see it at the edge. And he's at red health already. So we're doing pretty good if I might say so myself. <coughs> can we actually go to the top row? Because that's the only thing I don't know. Oh, we can. Uh, uh, we can actually. Okay. I thought I had to buy the ability. So let's get him up. Maybe we'll do like a crossbody or something. The only thing we don't have is a pin combination, which we will have to do. Oh, we do? Okay. That was awesome. Let's go for the pin. One, two, and the kick out from Hideo. I'm going to try and not make this stream not too long, but not too short either. I want to like either make it to NXT TakeOver in the stream. Or at least, uh, you know, go up against uh, Bobby Roode once. 
But the only match I will have up against Bobby Roode, I think, will be at NXT TakeOver. Which is a shame, because people who usually face off up against each other in a pay-per-view for a championship usually go up against each other either the week before or something. You know, they usually have a match a few weeks or only a week before the pay-per-view to see what kind of ability they both have in the ring. Okay, now Hideo with the comeback. Reversed. Back body drop. I thought I was going go. I, I thought I was gonna go for the German suplex, but it's still Gucci. Big boot. Oh, drop kick actually. I want to to buy the ability to have two finishers, two signatures and stuff. Well, you don't have to buy the ability for two signatures, but two finishers I have to buy the ability. So Hurricane Rana. <coughs> And the standing Shurinu. In this live stream, I will change my moveset a little bit. And my attire. But not right now. I will have to do like a week or two more. With my current superstar and attire and moves. And then I will change it. So we won the match against it. Really great match. I think it's 3.5 or 4 stars. I think 3.5. I don't know. I did like what? 2 finishers? 3. <coughs> Cross body off the top rope. Hurricane Rana again. Standing Shiranu. Isn't the standing Shiranu the old finisher for Seth Rollins? The um, Seth Walker, I think, yeah. So I could have the ability to break out, but I don't think that's a good idea since I'm a face in the company. I don't know why, uh, you know, I should attack somebody. So... What's up, Kira? Do you like the stream? Um, today I was supposed to go to the carnival and stuff with my friend, but he's here next to me instead because it was raining outside and the carnival couldn't happen. So, it's been like 10 minutes now, 12, yeah. Okay. Why are you nodding your head if I actually won the match? I don't know. <clears throat> okay, okay, yeah, not bad. Kind of impact you want on a first outing. <clears throat> like what you did out there tonight. We can work with this. Keep running that angle and you'll be fine, I think. You think I'll be fine? I just won a match. Not even congratulating me. What did you do in your career? Insulting people? So exit arena by talking. To the parking lot attendant. Need someone to grab your car? Yes, I'm done for the day. No, I have more stuff to take care of. Yup, grab my car. Thanks. <coughs> <coughs> so it's pretty cool with new animations this year that, you know, you could talk to people, interact, and stuff. But here's the thing. Um... The thing that you have to go and tell the parking lot attendant each and every week that you need to leave is a little bit, you know, too much. Because you need to go every week, every week, you know. But it's Gucci. Let's see what we can do next Wednesday on SmackDown. No, on NXT. I was going to say SmackDown Live. So, November 2018, week two. No way, Jose. Who else? Who else? Paul Ellering. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Who's in the office today? Nobody? Okay. Is there somebody here? Last time there was like, like I think, Akama Razor. Now there's Johnny Gargano. Okay. I would love to do a tag team with Johnny Gargano or somebody like that, you know? Wow. Tough draw for a second week match. Oh no, ain't no joke. I'm going up against Cassius Ono. Okay. I didn't even know. Spoiler alerts are all over this um, game. Match against one of our best guys. Up for it? Don't answer. Just do it. Need to show everyone you can perform in the ring. Or else you won't survive. Ring is where everything comes together. 
don't have that don't have anything show them what you got in you not for anything but you started talking to me and you said are you ready don't say anything like then why did you ask a question that's the only thing i'm curious of <coughs> So my channel, I think, is doing pretty good right now. Yesterday on the 2K18 um, live stream, I think I got like 7 views or something. And then on the past, I think, the two live streams before the WWE 2K18 one, I was doing pretty good at them. One of them... <coughs> I got 19 views and then the other the other one I think I got 24 or something so that's pretty good for my channel I only got like 14 subs or something so Matthew Storm against Cassius Ono I would like to beat him but you know that you know was kind of wrong what they did at the performance center because although it was supposed to be a squash match between you and Baron Corbin but at least you know they could have added the chance for you to win like either by roll up or like get a sneaky move in there or by submission maybe but no they wanted it to be a squash match and i realized that the hard way because the more i tried to fight him the more he fought back so you know <clears throat> but at least i did pretty good i wouldn't say i did the best out of all the youtubers i think but close because i don't know if somebody else survived that too long up against Baron Corbin in 2K18 career mode. Cash Sono, Matthew Storm, let's battle it out. As in Gurry. Already, come on, lights out. What is this? Bobby Roode. Oh, damn. Come on, no, no, no. Well, I reversed that, but okay. I think you're not supposed to reverse it because I've seen a lot of YouTubers doing that. And I reversed it right on time. If uh, it would have let me reverse it, I would have gotten it. So, you know. The, sh the thing they should do, instead of Bobby Roode attacking you and you not successfully beating him, it should be you if you major reverse the... Um, root bomb, I think it's called or something. Um, they should let this happen. If you major reverse his move, um, then you obviously knock him down and then get a finisher, perform it on Cash Isono, and then win the match. That should be a cutscene as well, but I don't know. Now you're clapping. So last week I won a match and you were nodding your head, and now. I got attacked and you're clapping. Yeah, that can happen at times. Jeez, that hurt. Looks like. Ouch. I guess that's why he's the reigning champion, huh? Big lesson for you. If you aren't on top of your game every night without fail, you can't beat him. I would have had caches if not for that. Bobby is going down. Please prevent that from happening. If not for that one in, I easily would have had caches. Sure. I mean it. Ugh. Look, what's happened is over. You move on, we move on. Lesson learned then? Lesson learned. Okay, file it away, keep it accessible. But I don't get Baron Blade. When we succeed, he's not happy. When we fail, he's happy. Like, why are you managing me if the only thing you're happy about is my failure? I don't know. Okay, we're done. Grab my card. Yes, let's go. So, I think... Yeah, I'm going to change my attire and my moveset now if I can. I didn't want to unlock too many moves. But, you know, since I bought the Hardy Boys pack and the NXT Generation pack or whatever it's called with Aleister Black and stuff and Ruby Riot... Maybe I have more moves that I unlocked. I'm going to change them and I'm going to try and change my tire because it doesn't look too good. But we'll see what we can do. 
I would love to have like the side effect of Matt Hardy and the twist of fate of Jeff. So let's pause the game right here. Um, go to sub menu. Then let's go to move set. Yes. Going to try and change as many moves as I can, but I don't know if I could do that. I'm gonna change my appearance and my move set to see if I can make it a little bit better. Because you know, a Hurricane Rana and the Standing Shirinu are pretty good moves, but not like not the best. So, practice play. A practice play mode. A practice play mode where you can input the same controls as matches has been newly added in move set. You can quickly check the feel of using an updated move set. Okay, thank you. So, special moves, signature. So we can actually have to. Okay, let's go to download it. Oh, we can actually pick all of these. Oh, good. Okay. Accordion Rack, which is Bat Phoenix, Air Raid Crash Neckbreaker 2, Alley Up 3, I didn't see this one. Oh, good, okay. Angle Slam, Ankle Lock, Ankle Lock, Apron Pile Driver. Oh, I've seen this one with like the trailer for the new moves pack with, um, what's it called? Rhino and Baron Corbin, I think he performed it on. Oh, that one I really do like. Armbar Stretch 3, Avalanche Angle Slam, Avalanche Twist of Fate I could actually do, Bag Breaker, Power Slam Combo, Backflip Spinning Heel Kick, oh, um, I think this is like RVD or something, yeah, Batista Bomb, Bicycle, Knee Strike 1, Bitter End, Black Mass 1 and Black Mass 2, Blackout, Blackout, Bop and Bang, Claymore, which is like the running dropkick of Drew McIntyre, Clothesline 23, Clothesline and building at Bulldog Combo, Corkscrew Moonsault, that looks pretty cool, I'm gonna set that, set that as my signature, downloaded, um, Corner Trapped Punches, 8, Crash landing. <coughs> Which one is this? Oh, okay. I think Cash is on or something. Cross leg mission hook driver. Cross leg Samoan driver. DDT 17. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, I said that one. So we will have since corkscrew is available on the outside. Let's do DDT. And another DDT, okay. Now for finishers, I only have one, but can I edit it from here? No. So we will we'll only have one, it's okay. Um, DDT, okay, so. Deadly Nightshade 1. Oh, I know this one, okay. Deadly Nightshade 2. The Capitator 3. Capitator 4. Discus knee strike 1. Discus clothesline 6. Diving elbow drop 10. Diving elbow drop 11. Diving fist drop 3. Foot stomp. Headbutt. Diving Mariora. Moon salt. Senton bomb. Double leg drop 2. Jeff Hardy, I think. No. Oh, okay. Dragon Slayer, Dragon Sleeper, Dragon Sleeper, another one. Drifter Stomps, <coughs> Drop Down, Gut Buster, Drop Kick, Emerald, Flosion, Fireman's Carry, Spine Buster. Sherman Suplex 6 5 Knuckle Shuffle 5 Star Frog Splash 
free fall glam slam front flip ddt future shock german suplex oh, i know which one this is glam slam i think i either do the glam slam or something else Galantine choke three is pretty good got run german suplex Hammerlock back suplex 2, Hammerlock DDT. Yeah, I'm gonna do either this one, that's like Andre, Andre at Cien almost, I think. Headlock Lariat, Backbreaker. Oh, okay. Headlock Punch 3, Hurricane Driver. Inverted Crush 1. Inverted Crush 2 Iron Claw Slam Kitchen Sink Knee Drop Scoop Slam I think I'm gonna do the Inverted Crush I think either 1 or 2 I'm gonna do number 1 Yeah, Inverted Crush 1 Downloaded Okay, so those are my new moves from my move set. Um, signatures, finishers. Okay, now for diving, I'm gonna change them a little bit. I'm gonna do a drop kick, and for the second one, I'm gonna do Mariora. From the middle one, I'm gonna do clothesline, and then that one I'm gonna do drop kick. So for down, I'm gonna do corkscrew moonsault, diving elbow, elbow, elbow. I mean foot stomp. I think I'm going to do Swanton Bomb and uh, I'm going to do either Diving Senton. This is this isn't even that much of a headbutt. <coughs> I think I'm going to do the Diving Senton Bomb too, yeah. Middle rope, I'm gonna do. Oh, there's a leg drop as well. I'm gonna do the leg drop. And then for this one, let's do diving sent on bomb. Yeah. So those are my moves for now. So, um, we'll do like. I think we'll do the first NXT TakeOver and then that will be it. So like, what, three more matches? This isn't gonna be too long of a live stream. But then I will do more live streams, I think, later on today with Fortnite and stuff. But I'm not sure about that. Now for my appearance, I'm trying to get a look either with wrestling tights or trunks. I don't know which one is better for me. I think for me, the better one is wrestling tights because trunks, it's more of like heavyweight. Although you see like Neville with trunks and stuff. But you know, I like wrestling tights more a little bit. <coughs> so depending on how much XP we get today, I will open some more loot boxes. Depending on how much VC we get. Because I'm not going to spend them all. At least not trying not trying to. Although I need to spend as much as I can. Because of the movesets and stuff. So an attire will have something that needs to be unlocked. <coughs> and I hope it's on clothing. Jackets. Yeah we have that one. Oh I have the Lou Gallows or Carl Anderson one. Elbow pad. Okay. So, hand we have. 
Oh, the Finn Balor ones. Okay, okay. So, um, I'm gonna go with lower body. So, let's go with wrestling tights. Let's see. Let's go in WWE and let's see which ones are available for us. These ones are available. Oh, okay. I think these ones are like from the Enduring Icons pack or something. Yeah. So, there's the Brie Bella one, which I will definitely not do. Sin Cara one, which, nah. And then these one. The f oh, which one are these? Not the Fabulous Freebirds. I forgot what their names are. So, I think I will do one of these. Oh, the Rock and Roll Express. Okay, okay. So... I think I will do this one. Um, uh, for colors, I will do black and uh, I think I will do black and blue, like SmackDown. So I will show them which brand I want to go to. That's white, and then this one. Oh, okay. I will do white. Okay. So we're done with the wrestling tights. All we need is to set up the shoes. <clears throat> I shouldn't do like slippers or like sports shoes I should like do long ones for example like these but not those specific ones oh we have a lot of a bit of available ones down here okay I think one of these because it actually goes with the outfit yeah, this one. So let's do black, white, and then this one, I think, blue, yeah. Or wait, no. Instead, let's do this one blue, and then this one white, and this one black. Okay. Then for those, we'll do white. So I think we are done from the attire. Let's see. Should I keep these on? this one um let's take them off yeah confirm now for head no we won't do anything because he's in the ring appearance a little bit of more hair and facial so for facial i will put like a really light one because he can't have a lot because it's only been like a few weeks yeah like that okay no no I don't like this ones full beard if we're gonna do a full beard we should do wait no well, let's just do that for now because he can't have a lot um, and for hair, I want to change this, but I can't give him a lot of hair. Oh, there are a lot of more options right now. And this one. And I think we'll just leave it at that for now. Okay, so. Face paint, or there's new face paint. Oh, the ultimate warrior one, okay. So I think we're done from that one. So, from the moveset and the tires, we're done. There's something else available on the tires, but I won't do it for now. Yeah, so that's good, okay. So... I don't have an entrance tire just because I skipped the entrances so it doesn't even have to even if he goes out only with like trunks and boots or something I don't even care because I skipped the entrances so why not 
my entrance I need to change a little bit or like the song because again the entrance I skip but you know we'll do that another day another time I think I will spend like what 25 more minutes playing and then that's it for this live stream an hour long I think yesterday I did like what two hour long live stream of Fortnite Battle Royale and then today I played with my friend Duo and we came in third place which is still pretty good but you know <coughs> could do a little bit better come in first place maybe again later on today I will try to upload another live stream try to make that happen I don't know if it's possible but maybe Johnny Gargano wait no last time we talked to Johnny Gargano now that was Tommaso Ciampa I mixed up their names I'm sorry so pumped week before NXT takeover must be excited this is your final chance to win over the WWE universe don't waste your TV time got it whatever you do make it count I will good go do it but I don't even know what I have to do so so my promo going up against Roderick Strong or Bobby Root should I attack Bobby Root since he attacked me or should I be a full on face and just focus on something else fighting it's between promo or fighting Roderick Strong right now I'm gonna fight Roderick Strong because I want to show people I got new attire move set and stuff so I want to show them that I'm ready for Bobby Roode I hope it won't be too hard because then it won't be that possible what I will try and possibly do in this live stream before the championship match at TakeOver is that I will try and upgrade my reversals because I only have two and that's not good at all <laughs> So, NXT is always in Orlando, Florida for some reason, at least in the game. So, um, let's fight Roderick Strong on NXT, Matthew Storm. Let's try and get another victory. We won a matchup against Hideo, and today we're going to try and win a match against Strong again. Underline and highlight the word try to. But we did pretty good up against Hideo Tami, so I don't know why we shouldn't do good up against Roderick. The only thing I'm a little bit nervous about is Bobby Roode, because <coughs> we might lose. And this is the stipulation for me. I try to do this every single match. If I lose the match, I can't do rematch. I just have to let it go, even with like Money in the Bank matches, maybe. Those, but like... Depending on how important it is, if it's like a WrestleMania 33 match, or like a ladder match, or Hell in a Cell match, I will decide later on. But championship matches, I'm going to try, and always, again, try and always uh, not do rematch, because it's sort of cheating, you know. But I will try again. <coughs> okay. My basic moveset is still the same. The only thing I changed is the signatures finishers and diving because those are the ones I you know really focus on you're not gonna finish a match by kicking him in the leg and that's it you know Hurricane Rana and then with the rebound drop kick going Jeff Hardy on them with the front flip boom there's one that you go running and then uh, do the leg drop of Matt Hardy. Oh, he reversed it. Okay, good, good. Gonna try and do it. I don't know if I can. Oh, he reversed it. I was gonna do it. I would have had him, but he reversed it. Knee drop. <coughs> <coughs> Kick to the face. Okay, knee. So... Roderick Strong trying to get back into this match, but I don't think so. 
Knocked him outside of the ring. Let's go for a top rope move. Maybe I'm gonna move on him. Okay, with the scent on. That was a pretty cool move. Now let's get him up. I'm gonna try and focus more on. <coughs> Wait, what is my finisher? Inverted crush. Okay. So I'm gonna try and focus more on his back and on his uh, head because those are the parts that I will really damage when I go for my finisher so let's get him up <sighs> okay Mariora now let's get him a little bit into the corner to do the leg drop from the middle rope okay these moves I actually do like I don't know why but moves like these like really short moves and small moves that do a lot of effect on the person I really do like clothesline now let's get him up for the signature which is <coughs> corkscrew moonsault or DDT 17 I'm gonna do the DDT for now wait I'm sorry I'm pausing it a lot but doesn't have the pin combo oh I only have the diving pin combo okay now let's get him up for the inverted crush, but he actually reversed it. Wow, okay. Nope. Oh, come on. I thought I reversed that one. That was pretty cool, though. I cannot lie. I have to admit. Of the ropes. Knee to the face. Reversed. Arm drag. Let's taunt with the backflip. Get him up. You know what I'm going to try and do? Get him up to the top. The very top, maybe? No? Okay. That glitch right there. Drop kick. He's almost at his signature, which isn't too good for us. Oh, come on. He reached it. I'm going to try and reverse his signature. If not, then finisher. Hope he doesn't even get one of them in. Two and a half star match. NXT. The objective for this match was only to win the match. Okay. So he has his finisher. The only thing I'm worried is because I don't think <coughs> that we actually have resiliency. Okay, we reversed. Okay. Drop kick. Perfect setup for the corkscrew. Corkscrew moonsault. Let's get down to it. Okay. And now, maybe this time we will do it. I hope we will. Okay, we did. Inverted crush number one. That's a pretty cool move, I might admit. Let's pin him. Cover. Let's go, ref. One, two, three. So I get the victory over Roderick Strong, Matthew Storm, with another win. Two weeks ago over Hideo, this time on Roderick Strong. Now next week we will be facing Bob Root for the championship. Maybe trying and get the victory first championship in our hands. We're doing pretty good on NXT. And then we will see if next week we will crown a new NXT champion or not. After the NXT TakeOver, I will be playing some more Fortnite and uh, doing live streams with my friends and stuff. Oh yeah, by the way, and if you're wondering if sometimes I do um, my live streams without, you know, speaking and stuff, it's because I'm in a party with a lot of friends and, uh, you know, a lot of people are talking at the same time. 44 minutes, 40 second live stream. He's mad because I won again. Okay. Piss off. That was a message. I think the champ hurt pretty loudly. I want him to know I'm coming. He should be. He shouldn't be champ. I have the fans in mind. This is all for the fans. I'm doing what I suspect they want. Fans are bow or crush you. Boo you. What? 
Friends can bow you or crush you under heel. Careful. They are capricious a lot. A capricious a lot. I don't know what that word is. Anyways, where are you? I'd be on edge right about now. He's noticed you. So watch out. Lightning does strike twice at times. That was a huge typo. Okay. I actually really do like this attire. Mad Bloom, okay. I didn't go to the other side where there's like the cafeteria and I think Mr. McMahon's office, I think, and what else? The other locker room with the treadmill and stuff and where you can take your poses and do your appearance and stuff, so. And signature t-shirt as well. So, do you actually get XP from having a signature t-shirt or no? Because last year it was getting XP and stuff every week, but this time I don't really know. Because if that is true, if that is so, then I will try and do a signature t-shirt with my own logo, try and come up with it. But you know, we'll try and see what we can do. Because if it gives me XP for selling t-shirts and being more popular, then I need that. So wait, no. Today isn't NXT TakeOver. It's this week later on. So this match and another one. And then I will maybe hopefully be champion. Triple H, let's try and talk to him. Okay, fine. I'll do it just this once, but don't tell anyone. I got two words for you. Suck it. Okay, the heck? Okay, bye. See you later, alligator. So, crazy week last week, huh? Up to you how you want to respond to what's been going down. Check out the match card. Let me know what you're thinking. Why was it crazy week last week? I only went up against one superstar, not like five, but okay. Matthew Storm, either promo, normal match with Bobby Roode, or one in. I'm gonna do a promo because I haven't talked to the WWE Universe or crowd or NXT crowd or universe before. I know you might be saying, then why, Matthew, are you ranting and stuff like that and talking about people usually have a match before the pay-per-view, before they collide at the pay-per-view, and now you didn't do it. But, you know, I want to talk to the people. I haven't talked to them since... Ever because I talk to myself at the performance center. So, <clears throat> so I will just do a promo now, and then on Sunday I will hopefully be the new NXT champion, try and win and get a victory over one of the best people in NXT currently in the game, of course, because now he's the United States champion on. Um, Smackdown Live. I would love to go to Smackdown Live because the United States, the United States Championship is like my second or third favorite championship of all of them. So promo time. Bobby Roode is completely in my way at TakeOver. The title match at TakeOver is coming and Bobby Roode is in my damn way. He stands there so smug in himself, thinking he can squat there forever. He's so self-satisfied, it's pathetic, and I don't like how that's stealing the spotlight from me. I'm the newcomer and I am the new... blah blah blah. Bobby Roode is coming out, okay. I am the champion and I'm going to stay the champion, period. Walk on out of here. Even if you tried, you'd fail every time. We aren't on the same level. Frankly, I'm insulted. You seem to think we are. We're uncomparable. Everyone is rooting for my legitimate victory. Okay. Everyone, and I mean everyone, is rooting for me. I don't know if you won your championship fairly. I doubt it. But me, I intend to achieve a legitimate victory over you. My fans expect it. Maybe that means you'll fight dirty. I don't know, and I don't care.
you're an upstar and you need to start knowing your place that ain't here and it's definitely not in a ring with me you aren't worthy of a second under my spotlight how did they ever let you get this far fine you can't be here but you gotta dot 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 my name is the one the audience chants have you heard the audience i'm not arrogant enough to call them all my fans but i can tell you right now that it's my name that they're chanting not yours you has been mine over and over that must get to you the audience and my fans are one and the same there is no one out there pulling for you got it to them you're a no-name fool i can't even remember your name but everyone no matter where i go remembers the love they've given i've given tenfold i've heard them i felt the love everyone is giving me i'm going to return it to them do you hear me i'm going to give it back to them tenfold you see that's how i do things when i give back i really mean it i wonder that you've ever given anyone other than yourself You'll be stuck here forever, although more likely you'll be kicked out. I haven't seen anyone, anything impressive from you. You, wait, no, impressive from you. And I doubt that's going to change. You see, there's a certain degree of amplitude. Whenever I'm worthy to be here in doubt, I won't give in or give up. I'm too driven. I won't be giving in to your pressure or giving up in the face of challenging you i think too hard to get to this point and i can't let anything get in the way now giving up is easy and to a fault i've never take the easy way out you cannot stop the force of our combined power or easy way in or whatever you're going to have to learn to deal with it, Bobby. With their power combined with my power, we are an unstoppable force of victory. You can't hope to defeat us or even deflect a single shot. I'm going to hurt you so much, I know it. All I can say is, I'm going to beat you. That's it. You want to say something? Say it to my face and let's go. So that was pretty intense. The promo results screen shows the points you earned at each stage of your promo each time you match the stone and the tone and topic from your previous step. Your score increases to get a perfect promo. You need to maintain the same tone and topic for all steps of the promo. So we did pretty good. We actually beat bobby Roode in that promo now all we need to do is beat him next week in a one-on-one -on -one match for the championship so next sunday is nxt takeover i will try to beat bobby Roode for the championship So today is Sunday, it is currently 15.58, so Baron Blade is not too happy again. Not bad, okay, not bad at all to Nighting King, the WWE Universe is looking forward to what you are bringing at your NXT U. I think they get it. I can't wait to storm Bobby. I want to impress you. Fans are going to go crazy. All the fans are going to go crazy when they see us together. This match will be nothing they've seen in NXT. Don't know about that. Fans have a long memory. Have seen a lot of thrilling moments. This will be something special. It's a feeling I get. Okay. Channel that feeling in your performance, I guess. Whatever your reason, make it a good match. That is what I value as important. 
Bye. Can you help me reach 100 subs? I'm two away, please. Okay, I will try and help you. Um, link your channel in the bio or say what the name is of the channel in the comments below, and I will try and help you. Okay, we are ready. So, NXT TakeOver is coming up next. That will be the final match of this live stream, and then that will be it. And then later on today, I will be playing some Fortnite Battle Royale, trying to get another victory. I think two days ago, I got a squad victory. So, um, I want to get a solo victory in Fortnite, but it seems to be pretty hard. The best I've ever gotten was like what? Um... 7th place, so I'm going to sub to you right now, Wolfie Slayer, can you sub me, okay, so I'm going to YouTube right now, real quickly, Wolfie Slayer, that my channel, Wolfie Slayer, okay, Wolfie Slayer, um, we're almost at 100 subs, so, 2 away, so 98, I will try and find you because there are 3 right now, there's one with 84, one with 5, and one with 0. I'm going to sub later, okay? I will find the channel and sub to you. Guaranteed you will get 200 today, okay? If you do get 200 subs, um, comment down below. In the live stream, if it's still on. Or in the next live stream today, if you reach 100 and I will shout your channel out. Made it this far. Ready to go a little further? Better be. This is your first title shot. Get angry or something that works. How do you feel? Thrilled? Anxious? You don't care? Yeah, I'm gonna say that. I'm not sure why you ask. You don't care one way or the other. Nope. I want to bottle whatever it is. Then let it explode in the ring. Like that part the best. The explosion of emotion crowd loves that squander this opportunity and it's not me who'll yell at you that'd be easy yelling at yourself is what you'll do over and over until you're mad so don't do that got it don't go mad right avoid that seeing what the nxt title has done for guys like finn kevin owens and nakamura haven't you could have that too if you win i was born to do this that's pretty specific, but hey, go with that, and don't mess up. Win the NXT Championship, cannot win by DQ or Countdown, get a match rating of 3 stars. The picture is red triangle with fox under. Sub now quick, sub to me, please, okay. So I've seen Pro2Gamer, sub to me, I sub to you, okay. So I think I'm sub to pro to gamer as well. So this one I will sub to. Okay. So you did a 2K18 live stream Fortnite. Okay. And Call of Duty. So I subbed right now. I have a total of 98. Now I'm going to pro to gamer. Pro to gamer. I think it's this one. Yes, okay. Pro to gamer I sub to you. You have a total of five subs. And the last video you did was New Crossbow Road to Ten Wins, two hundred forty five kills. Okay. So I subbed to both of you. Now if you can sub to my channel, um that will be pretty cool. If you didn't already sub, please go sub down below. One away pro gamer. Can you sub to me? Okay. So I'm gonna check how many subs I have. Or no, I'll check later. We're during the live stream going to win the NXT Championship. Again, if you're not subbed to my channel, go subscribe right now. Turn the post notification turn the post notifications on and like the live stream and all the other Gucci stuff. So Matthew Storm versus Bobby Roode for the NXT Championship coming right up. So, 
let's try and win the NXT championship. I would love to win and get that win over Bobby Roode. One of the best people at NXT right now. I feel anxious, I feel nervous, I'm excited. So NXT Championship on the line, try to win it. Matthew Storm, I hit 100 boy, thanks guys. I'll shout you out when I get a new PS4 controller, okay. Good luck in your future endeavors and congrats for the 100 subs. I'm at like what, 18? So, already with the reversal, and I forgot to upgrade my reversals. Wow, okay. Good start. Okay. How many reversals can one have? Ask Bobby Roode and he'll answer. It didn't even show me the window to reverse, let alone. Too fast. So, backbreaker. Side rush and leg sweep. Get him into that ring. I have no reversals. He has to, so I will try. Nope. When you try your best, but you don't succeed, is the song for me right now because I'm trying my hardest. Okay, reversal. Yes, Ezinger finally getting the upper hand. If he reverses a stomp from the ground, that would be pretty cool because, yes, okay, he doesn't have any more reversals left. Okay. Arm drag. Hurricane Rana. He has no reversals, so I will try and do as many moves as I can. Up on top. Come on, let's get him. Yes, Hurricane Rana. If I hit this. Yes, okay. A lot of damage done. Now let's drag him into the corner. Big moment right now. Leg drop. Now let's go top rope. I'm really anxious for some reason. <coughs> Swanton bomb. Did some damage right there. Yes, okay. Hurricane Rana. Get him down. Three kicks to the leg. Okay, so he has taken more damage than us. F finally. Okay. He's getting up out of the ring now let's try and do another move i think it's like the diving senton now it is now what i will do is get him a little bit further and then do a missile drop kick from up here okay get up come on missile drop kick right on the dot now let's get, me, get him into the ring because I cannot win by DQ or count out or whatever. So, <sighs> signature coming up. Let's go. Two people, 21 comments. Boom, DDT. Let's go. Now, get him up. <sighs> okay. Inverted. Crush. And NXT TakeOver replay highlight. Come on, go for the cover. If we can beat him, I will scream. One, two, three. Oh my god, we beat him with the first finisher as well. So we beat him, I don't know how, with the first finisher. But wait, did I get three stars if I didn't? Oh my god, right on the mark. Three stars, won the championship, not by DQ, not by count out. I am the best right now.
NXT champion new one crowned and to end it off I will be buying another loot case or whatever and I will upgrade my reversal stats I'm excited So we've been live streaming for one hour, five minutes, and 40, no, 50 seconds now. I am thrilled. I am the new NXT champion after, after like four weeks, I think, or something. Finally, happy for my success. Thank you so much. Nice. Seriously, that's it. Super nice. Like pulling teeth. What are you grousing for? You did it. You, sir, are a born champion. I am the master of all worlds. Every fan was cheering my name. And yet I still haven't depressed you. Yes. And yet despite all the hard work and everything, you still aren't impressed with me at all. Haha. -ha. Get over yourself. Here for the spec spectacle of it all. Me. Wait, no. Here for the spectacle of it all, me. You're simply part of that. Had fun watching. How about that? Satisfied? Marginally. Or whatever that word was. Ha, you're funny. Check in with Matt before you run out. Or run off. Once a few words prior to your heading out. See you. Matt Bloom wants to talk to me after winning the championship. Hey kid, kid, you floored everyone with that. I knew you had it in you, right from the start. See, this is what I wanted. Bet on the fact that you, this very instant, are on the fast track to success. Like, keep putting on great matches like that. Keep making all the right decisions, working your fights at the and the audience over. You might find yourself main eventing WrestleMania one day. That's like the dream of everyone. You might do it too. Your backing got me here. Not sure that odd producer helped. This is when I truly begin. Not that everyone seem me trash in the ring. I feel like this is the time when I truly begin my story. Some moments in time do crystallize after a fight. Everything is like backstory and this is the main thing. Pretty big deal though, no lie. Listen, gotta take off. Great job kid. You wrecked it. So proud of you. I did, I did indeed and that will be the end of the live stream in a few moments let's first upgrade my attributes let's go to attributes um reversals right here i only get up one i think yeah so now if we have enough yeah we have like eighteen thousand seven hundred seventy eight um xp oh, I was gonna say V-Bucks for some reason. Now, let's go to exit my career. So that was amazing. We are the new NXT champion. We beat Bobby Roode. We've been in Hideo Tami. We've beaten Roderick Strong. We've done a promo, which we beat Bobby Roode in that. So we're doing pretty good on NXT. Pretty excited how we do on the main roster. Either SmackDown Live or Raw, I will defeat everybody in my path so let's buy a 10,001 golden and we will get a drum roll please five red cards okay so sideburns 8 6500 xp shoes number three advanced toughness duration five matches and advanced athleticism duration five matches let's get another 10,000 on that because we got like 9,700 or something XP four red cards and one gold 
Balanced Brawler, Duration 1 match, Ultimate Wounds 18, Hands 53, British Bulldog Shoes 1, and Advanced Writing, Duration 5 matches. Now let's do a 5000 one, and that will be it. If we, go, if we don't get more XP, of course. And we get 3 Gold and 1 Red. Power, Duration 1 match, 2150 XP. Advanced stamina duration five matches and Tyler Breeze tops number one. We don't have enough for the bronze. We would have to um what's it called? Oh yeah, we would have to get seventy two more. So that is gonna be it. I bought some loot cases from the loot case store. We've beaten Bobby Roode. And we became the NXT champion. And that's going to be it for this live stream. And see you guys in the next one. Bye.